Today we have a fascinating show about European explorers. The European explorers of North America changed the world. Period, dot, period, period, dot. What reasons did Europeans have to explore? European explorers were motivated by something I like to call the three G's. Gold, that's riches and wealth. God, the desire to spread religion. And glory, fame from discovering a new land. I'm going to add another G, greed. They wanted more than they already had and were willing to exploit other lands to do so. What obstacles did European explorers have in exploring North America? European explorers had many obstacles including a lack of supplies, unfamiliar climates, and a lack of food. European explorers had many accomplishments. For one, they did quote-unquote discover new land for the Europeans that they didn't know existed before. And also, they improved trade. What were some examples of cooperation and conflict between the European explorers and American Indians? Well, cooperation included technology and trade. Conflict between European explorers and American Indians included the claims to land, diseases, culture differences, and the lack of communication between the European explorers and American Indians. Hmm. We sailed the ocean blue in 1492. But who in the world is Christopher Columbus? Christopher Columbus was an Italian that was sponsored by Spain. He went on four voyages and he explored the Caribbean. He established colonies for Spain. Who was Giovanni Caboto? <clears throat> John Cabot. John Cabot explored from 1497 to 1498. He was another Italian explorer, but instead of being sponsored by Spain, he was sponsored by England. England wanted to find a northwest passage to Asia, and when he traveled and landed in Canada, he claimed most of it for England. Who was Vasco Nunez de Balboa? Vasco Nunez de Balboa was a Spaniard that was sponsored by Spain. He sailed to present-day Panama in Central America. He crossed the dense mountains and jungles of Panama and was the first European that reached the Pacific Ocean. Talk about cooperation, Balboa married the daughter of a local Indian chief. Oh, uh -huh, oui, oui. Who was Jacques Cartier? Jacques Cartier was a French explorer that traveled in pursuit of an easier trade route to Asia. He explored the St. Lawrence River. He brought French influence into North America, specifically Canada, where in Quebec, the main language is predominantly French, thanks to Jacques Cartier. Who is Hernando de Soto? Hernando de Soto was a Spanish explorer that explored Peru with fellow conquistador Francisco Pizarro. What is a conquistador? A conquistador is a Spanish word for conqueror. He explored the southeastern United States from Tampa Bay to South Carolina and was the first European to cross the Mississippi River. Who was Henry Hudson? Henry Hudson was from England and sailed for the country of the Netherlands, also known as the Dutch, and England. He was trying to find the Northwest Passage. His crew mutinied and threw him off the ship. And more bodies are named for Henry Hudson than any other explorer in North America. Well, that about wraps it up. Thank you so much for watching. Hey, hey, thanks for watching our show. Check out our Teachers Pay Teachers store. Follow us on Instagram, like us on Facebook, and check out our many Pinterest boards. Pop, 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 pop in, Mr. Horton, bow tie guy, still not stopping. Check out my YouTube channel where you can check out new videos being uploaded all the time. Bow, 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 bow tie guy has a bow, 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 bow blog and you needed to check it out. Here we go www.bowtieguyandwife.com. Check it before you wreck it. See ya.